and have just concluded class of 1999 to The Substitute, which I believe is the first uh, zero on the tomato meter that I've actually seen. I'll have to do a little more research on that. But let's just remember that just means there's no positive reviews. Doesn't mean, you know, it doesn't mean it's not mediocre. It doesn't mean it's totally offensive. So, um, and it's nowhere near either, I think, in the end, uh, class 1984, class of 1999, in terms of quality and being a direct sequel to class of 1999, you can't do this without the cyborg effects. But to its credit, it comes off the story that lets you negate these by having, well, that's spoiler alert stuff. But basically there is one teacher who's now just going from school to school believed to be a battle droid from Megatech who just goes and kills all the bad students and moves on to the next town. And this time he's come to a school where there's a teacher, well, and honestly, the only gang activity really is that there's a teacher who is trying wants to testify against a attempted murder or and keeps being opposed because that would shake up the small little town fortunately for her sasha mitchell from step by step and kickboxers two three and four has arrived in town and he's taking out the trash and it turns out to be more of something she's conflicted with than deterred by so it kind of addresses, like, basically, all right, we have evil students this time. This isn't like class 1999 where it's just kill a bunch of kids. And we have a teacher who you're cheering on for killing the kids. Now, the action is, there's actually some nice, I think, sequences of uh, early on with um, Sasha Mitchell taking out, out little gang units. But once you get to the finale, which is supposed to be an ode to the gang wars of class of 1999, it kind of falls apart. I mean, it's still fun to see some of the old Vietnam style kills, but so it's nothing really impressive, but you got to appreciate the story. Um, Sasha Mitchell only has two modes, goofy or stoic, so kind of works for him and i can't say the other actors phoning in so it's not really worth your time i suppose but if you enjoyed class of 1999 i think the curiosity will get the better of you and it's not as bad as it's indicated to be so i think really the moral of the trilogy is damn these white kids and their mass shootings because We've lost the entire concept of school exploitation features. Too bad.